Good morning, everyone. It is Saturday morning and I figured I would do a weekend vlog. Usually on Saturday mornings, we have a military training period. And then after that, at around 12 o'clock, we'll get Liberty so we can go hang out with our friends and do whatever. But I'm just gonna be doing homework this morning and uh, yeah. I'll take you along today. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this on military, lifestyle, and faith. I just got back from Lower Field. There were some sled dogs down there that a faculty member brought in for cadets to go see and ride, and it was so awesome. So they've been trying to do a lot of fun stuff like that for us here, since we have limited options for Liberty with COVID. So I'm super thankful for that, and now I'm just taking advantage of every opportunity that I can. So I think that we are gonna go to Chick-fil-A this afternoon, so that'll be a good time. And uh, yeah, see you later. Also, beat my World Out Good Foot shirt. Sadie Rob's podcast. Go listen. So I'm walking on my way back from water polo practice. I've played water polo for the past two years that I've been at the academy. It's a lot of fun. It's a club sport. So it's not too much of a time commitment, but it still keeps me in shape and hanging out with my girls. So it's been fun. Got a um, OCF, which is Officers Christian Fellowship. Got a guest speaker's night. And so we'll be watching that live stream and should be a good time. So that pretty much wraps up my night. Um, I'm exhausted. Practice took a lot out of me today and I don't know about you all, this might be just a me thing, but uh, it takes a lot of energy to be social these days. <laughs> it takes a lot out of me. I think I'm gonna just watch some YouTube, maybe some Hawaii Five-0 and uh, head to bed. Doing these vlogs, it's making me really excited for when I can have an apartment after I graduate and be able to do things like cook my own food and like have a nice big fluffy duvet comforter things like that I'm just really looking forward to and it's simple things like that we're getting through it and only got a year and a half left so you know you do your time and you make the most of it so yeah I will uh see you guys in the morning I cannot wait until 
we can go to church in person continually again. I miss it so much and I love being able to watch a church that's back in my home state, but you know, it's it's something different when you can gather in person and you can worship in person and you can take communion in person and I am very excited to get back to that and you know, it's been a tough season, but I mean, the Israelites, they were in the desert for 40 years, so we can take this. God is going to meet us here right where we're at, and I just want to have my heart open to that and just, God is working. God is good all the time, and I am so thankful for that. <laughs> I can trust in Him no matter what comes. It is 35 degrees outside in Connecticut in February. They're going for a dip. Polar plunge. Two, one. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Yeah, they're having it. It's like a tropical paradise for them. Well, my feet are wet. I'm already so cold and I'm I'm not that cold. Go. It's really not that tropical. Bad. Go, go, go. <laughs> <laughs> How do you feel? <laughs> Maddie, how do you feel? I feel great, but my toes are numb. <laughs> I don't know how they're still in the water. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I thought it was going to be. <laughs>